Hello everyone and thanks for visiting Bluebeam Back to Basics. Today we'll be talking about the new markup filtering tool in Review 20. For those of you I have not met personally, you can reach me at that phone number and email address and we encourage you to visit our website where you can learn all about our Bluebeam training program. I have my screen split in half with Review 2019 running on the left and Review 20 running on the right. I have two copies of the same exact file open at the same time and in those files I've created a series of custom columns for information like state, county, city, population, and so on. Each of those is controlled by an area measurement markup. Let's see how I can filter that information with Review 2019. If I go to the markups list and choose the filter command, each column heading now has a filter capability. What I'd like to do is filter out everything except Texas and Oklahoma. So in Review 2019, I would choose Oklahoma, and then I would come back and add Texas. But you notice when I try to do that, it turns one off and the other on. So I have to go to Custom, and there I can say OR equals, and choose Oklahoma, and get to both. Now let's compare that exact same thing in Review 20. In Review 20, they've relocated the filter command. It's no longer in this general area here. It's right in the middle of the interface. So I choose the filter list, and every column header does get the same type of thing, but it behaves differently. So if I go to State, and I click on it, I can choose Oklahoma, and then I can just choose Texas. Now I've achieved the same filter result with fewer steps. If we go back to review 2019, I can now add additional filters. I'll go to county, for example, and say I want to filter everything by Harris County. That caused everything in Oklahoma to disappear because in my database there are no counties named Harris in Oklahoma. Let's see the same thing in review 20. If I go to county and set it to Harris, achieve the same thing. But what if I wanted to go in and I wanted to filter based on a value? For example, I want to see all cities in either of those two states that have a population that's greater than one value but less than another value. If I go back to Review 2019 and I remove the county filter, now if I go to population, I can select an existing population or I can attempt to do that with custom, but the tools just aren't there. I've got equals, does not equal, and that's about it. Let's see how that's been enhanced in Review 20. If I go back to Review 20 and I clear out the county filter, so now if I go to the population column, I can choose custom, and I can take advantage of the new filtering capabilities. I can indicate that I'd like to see all cities who have a population that is greater than 500,000 and is also less than 1,500,000. And we can see that Oklahoma City and El Paso are the only two cities in Texas or Oklahoma within my database that meet that filter criteria. Now, if I clear that filter out completely in both Review 20 and in Review 2019, if I need to repeat that search sometime in the future, in Review 2019, there's no way for me to recall it. I would have to re-perform all of those steps from scratch. In Review 20, when I do a filter, under the Settings option now, I can choose to save that filter for future recall. So here we can see my filters that I've done in the past. Arkansas and New Mexico cities between 100,000 and 500,000 population. If I turn that on, we can see that in my database, the only city that meets that criteria is Little Rock. And I can turn that on or turn it off with just a click of a button. I can then change it to my other save filter and get back to the El Paso and Oklahoma City results. Now admittedly, this is probably something you wouldn't do in Bluebeam. You'd probably use ArcGIS or some other GIS application for this type of thing. But I think it illustrates the potential of the new filtering capabilities in Review 20, which are only limited by your imagination. That's it. I hope you find this video helpful, and you'll review the other videos available as well.